everyone welcome back to my youtube channel so in this video let's uh, do the setup okay with the uh, mysql so uh, let's connect the dbt uh, core with the mysql uh, so this uh, plugin is not officially available uh, but we'll see like uh, how we can do the uh, setup with the mysql so if you open the docs okay so here they have given the uh, necessary steps to install the dbt mysql connector and uh, so uh, so only tested uh, dbt adapters are like in, in mysql is mysql 5.7 mysql 8.0 and mariadb and here you can uh, see the supported features right uh, so based on um, uh, the versions so you can see like uh, what are different features it supports uh, if you go with mysql 8.0 it supports all the features like table metalization view metalization incremental snapshots docs right okay so let's try to do the setup uh, so let me open my uh, anaconda prompt first let's create an environment so i'll create an environment uh, conda create my environment name and give my sql env and the python version i'll be using python 3.7 yes so it will create the new environment with necessary packages, right? So meanwhile, let me, okay, so it got installed. So next is, let's activate the environment. So if I do conda env list, so right now I'm in the base environment, right? So let me activate uh, the environment whichever i've created the environment name is mysql env right so mysql env. okay so here is my mysql env so let's activate that conda activate mysql env and hit enter okay so right now i'm in mysql env so let me create a, a folder i'll go to my file explorer so let me create one simple folder so i'll go to downloads and here let me create a new folder called test mysql let me create that let me open this folder and let's copy this i'm just copying the path i'll navigate here cd to this okay so if i do di right now i don't have any files and folders right the first step is to install the dbt core so pip install uh, dbt core so it will install uh, the dbt core uh, in my environment with the latest version okay so even we can check the version okay so let's just install all the necessary packages If I check dbt version, uh, dbt version, okay, so it's the latest version 1.4.6. This is my latest version. I don't have any plugins, 
so let's install the plugin uh, so the command is pip install dbt mysql so let me copy this and paste it over here So even uh, so you can see uh, so here uh, even it's all in dbt core because if you read the docs even it's telling installing dbt mysql will also install dbt core so directly you can install pip install dbt mysql or you can install dbt core and install pip install dbt mysql okay everything is fine uh, so i go to my command prompt okay so now if i let's check the dbt version Okay, you can see all the three plugins got installed uh, MariaDB, MySQL, and MySQL 5. Uh, so now, if I do dir, right now I don't have any files and folders, right? So now let's initialize the project. So let's do dbt init. I need to enter the name of the, my project. I'll enter uh, SQL Pro. Okay. So I need to enter which database I need to connect. I'll connect with this uh, MySQL number two. Okay. So I'm done with the setup. So let's navigate to the path. So if I do dir, so I can see the project name got created. Project folder that is SQL Pro. So let's change directory to the uh, SQL Pro. And if I do dir, I have all the files and folders, right? So the important file is even have dbtproject.ml file. So if I go to my uh, profiles, right? So it will be under users, your username and dot dbt, right? So if I go to my profiles, so here I have all the, my project details, right? Uh, so if I see, so I have this uh, SQL Pro, right? So let me connect to that. Uh, so let me delete my some older projects okay so this is my project name right uh, so here i need to enter first the server so the server is localhost localhost uh, the port so if you check the port it's 3306 right so this is the default port so let me enter 3306 3306 and next is database so i'll just open my my workbench i have the database called test db and have some example like sales uh, table okay so i have a test db so let me add the database as test db uh, test db this is optional but in the schema what uh, in the schema you will be entering your uh, database name okay if you check the docs uh, in the schema so specify the database to build the models right so uh, where i uh, where all the models will pushed into right so i need to specify the schema name so let me select the same uh, database okay so uh, test uh, db and i need to enter the username and the password to uh, to connect my sql server so my this is my username root and let me enter the password let's do let's save this okay so now if i go to my uh, command prompt and type dbt debug okay to check the connections okay so here you can see my connection was successful so uh, it uh, so profiles.ml was founded and it was valid as well as the connection is uh, is also tested right so its connection is also passed so this is how we connect uh, mysql with uh, dbt